Jenna and welcome to my channel. Welcome back if you've been hanging out with me and um, oh yeah just knock me over. I there's so many things I really want to fit into this video and hopefully I'm not one of them but um it's been a few days since I've talked to you guys and um I know that um uh I told you guys about the car issues and all that stuff two accidents within a month and then within a little less than a month of getting my replacement vehicle the transmission went out it's just been so much fun and plus working full time so yeah it's been great yay but I try to always look at the bright side and you guys always help me with that so I appreciate you guys also very much just want to fit a couple of quick topics into this video I want to try to keep it yeah I don't want to bore you but, um, and yes, I will say who won the giveaway, and, um, yes, this time, uh, okay, I'll explain this, but I always do the, um, giveaway on a random draw, it's always very, very fair, it's always been, if some of you have been hanging out with me for a couple years or so, and always fair, but, um, if I have to redo a video because of a mechanical issue or something, like my battery died, <laughs> um, I can't. If somebody won, I can't take that away from them and then do another re... I can't redo the random drawing. So the winner is the winner, and I apologize. I normally love to show it live, but I think that at this point, you guys already know that I would never lie about it um, or anything like that. Um, it's the winner's the winner, and um, I didn't pick it based on a question or based on anything. Like, for example, the last freaking giveaway and my best friend won it and y'all saw that live y'all saw me do the random drawing and she won it um i can't i can't take away from the person who won so just because my battery died um before the video ended that doesn't mean i can take away from the person who won so she won fair and square but it's just not one of the times when i'll show it live but anyway i keep repeating myself anyway few things I wanted to touch on today. I hope we can get to them all. That would be so lovely. And if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up where you see the thumb right below. Thumbs up if you like it. I got a band-aid on my thumb because I accidentally picked the skin. When it gets really cold and dry, I have a bad habit of like picking on the sides of my thumbs. And um, yeah, so anyway, that's a bad thing to do. Anyway. One quick thing I wanted to bring up that has nothing to do with the giveaway. It has nothing to do with um, me. Well, sort of, maybe. I don't know. Anyway, it's just I like to watch other people's Reborn Baby channels as well. And um, I love, I'm always learning new things. And I love sharing new ideas. And I'm not going to mention any names. But I just have to bring up this one um, YouTuber. I won't mention her. But she does a lot of tutorials and she's very helpful. I've learned lots of tips and tricks. Um, I also have some of my own tips and tricks. And I am more than happy to share them with everybody. If I find out something that works so much better than what I thought, I will be like, hey, you guys got to try this because it works awesome. Well, this one woman I found online, she will do tutorials. But then she'll say, well, and I have like, well, okay, I'm... She'll say, like, quote, unquote, well, I actually have a much better and easier way to do this that I do, but that's my secret. And um, so I'm just going to show you this lesser way. Anyway, I was watching her videos and I thought, you know, that's a pretty crummy thing to do. I understand that if you're some like a magician or something, you know, you don't tell your secrets. But this is an art. This is something that we we can share. And just because you tell your secrets, like maybe you've found the best way to, or the best color combinations to crease with, that doesn't mean just because you share that information that you found out, that doesn't mean, first of all, that everyone's going to go run out and do it. And, you know, because not everybody reborn. But second of all, it doesn't mean that they even can. And third off... What the heck kind of a person are you to be that nasty? I'm sorry, but that's just nasty. If I found the absolute best idea, the 
best way to really make um, your reborn even better, I would freaking be like, hey guys, guess what? Do this, you know? I mean, that's just ridiculous. Anyway, my desk is clean, and I know you're probably thinking, that's clean? But yeah, for me, this is actually clean. And in the spirit of not hiding crap like that, oh my gosh, that woman, I'm sorry. Maybe I'm out of line, but I just think, don't be telling people like, well, here's how you crease, but I have a better way that I just won't share with you. That's just a bunch of buttholes. I mean, I'm sorry, gosh. I gotta wash my mouth. I don't know. Anyway, one thing is, I'm, I don't really know if I like these things because they do hold, I like to premix a lot. This is, um, right here is one of my um, uh, creasing uh, formulas. Um, and I like to premix so that I have them handy, but, and I like these jars because they don't seem to thin them, or they don't seem to make them evaporate too much. But the only problem is, is that, um, when you pop them on, they seal so well, you can keep your formula that you've mixed, that I'm happy to share, by the way. You can keep that formula, um, but the only problem is when I go to open it, I'm always scared that it's gonna, you know, throw stuff around. But these jars do um, uh, hold them and keep them really well. So I've got my creasing one. This, I believe, is a mottling one that I need to refill. This is a regular skin color one. And this is a veining one. And um, here are some paints. And a drying rack and scissors and a bunch of brushes. And um, I don't know, a sponges and other sponges. I ruined these sponges. Look what I did. I know it's horrible. Anyway, enough about me and on to the bebes. Oh, and this is just, um, this is a micro premium leg that I was going to do some kind of demo on just to show what this awful lady was not going to share. But we're running low on time now, so and plus I want to get to the giveaway. But in the meantime, we are going to say, well, we can say hello to my snake, Mara, but she's in the cave. Or cave. She's in her cave. But um, And then um, we're going to um, say... Hello really quick to um, Reese, because she's here having her little uh, sippy, and she's bored of listening to me too. And we are going to say goodbye to a Kaylin, and this is a Kaylin we're saying goodbye to. She just got a new mommy today, and um, I had, she is, today is January 5th, and she is the fifth baby of the new year to get a new mommy, so... I'm really excited for that, so yay. And then really, really quick, because we're going to be pushing 10 minutes on this one. But, oh, there's my flip-flop. It's adorable. I know. So cute. Um, okay, well, you got to look at something while I'm reading off the winner. Ugh. Okay, well, you can look. This is not the gift, by the way. This is Mariah, and she is, um, she's just a baby that's here. And um, she is up for adoption, so... And if anybody's ever interested in adopting a baby from me, you're more than welcome to message me on here. Um, or also, you can check my eBay store, which is um, Jenna, uh, what is it? All lowercase, um, I think it's all lowercase. Jenna JDS11 on eBay. But actually, you're probably best off just um, talking to me from here because I usually can work with you a little bit more one-on-one. -on -one. But either way. Some fun questions that I was asked um, from some people. Um, um, but, or should I tell the winner first or the th questions? I don't really know how to do this one this way because I had, this is my second attempt and I'm just kind of winging it. But okay, I will answer questions from people who did not win, which sounds really horrible, but they were good questions. Um, Valnelli05, she asks me, um, what is my wish for 2018? My wish is always for the health and self bleh health and safety of my family and friends. And um, um, in addition for this year in particular, um, I wish for better luck with uh, vehicle situations. Um, um, let me see, I'm gonna try to be quick. Um, somebody, um, Leanne Cortez, uh, Cortez, Cortez, um, she asked, how old was I when I started reborning? Um, I think I was 40, um, I'm 43 now, so anyway. Um, somebody asked, and I didn't write the name down, I'm so sorry. Um, somebody asked if I prefer sleep or awake babies. Um, 
It depends, really. Um, as far as looking realistic and um, that kind of thing, I prefer asleep. They look more like they could really be babies. Um, but as far as like the personalities and stuff like that, sometimes um, I prefer awake. Just kind of depends. I love them both so very much. It's very difficult for me to say, but I think at the end of the day, if I have to pick one, I'd say I prefer sleepers. Okay. Um, um, there's so many more questions, but I just don't have much time, and I think I just need to say who the winner is. Um, and oh, oh, I do want to mention this one though. Um, Carla Jane asked me, do I put a marker on my babies? Like, meaning like, do something like, to distinguish that I made it, that some kind of little, like, distinguishing mark, I suppose that's what she meant, that, um, would, you know, be my little signature mark, I guess. Um, and that, that's a neat question, um, uh, Carla, and, um, I had not, and, but I'm definitely gonna start, and I will definitely let you guys know what I choose to do for that. Um... Anyway, um, oh, just some more. And I will try to, in the next video, get to more. But we're at 11 minutes. So, yeah, I think, I'm, I think I've run my course. But now the winner. So, yay. I know. I've just gone on and on and on way too much. But the winner is, if your name is Tracy Jude. Okay? You won. Tracy Jude. And, oh, she doesn't even know what she won yet. Okay, well, anyway, I will say her question was, she said, can I put eye color in the babies? And, um... Uh, well, the sleepers, you just shade them, but um, for awake babies, you actually purchase separate eyes. I'll show you a quick example. These are an example of um, uh, some 18 millimeter eyes, and um, you, you you have to put them inside their, um, inside their heads. And I can explain that in more detail later, but let me tell you what the heck you won, sweetie, if your name is, oh, I said it and I don't want to forget, Tracy Jude. Um, you want a baby, and I wasn't actually sure I was going to do a baby, and she's not quite all the way finished, but she's the Maisie Sculpt, and here's a sneak peek of your baby. She's the Maisie. She is about a 14-inch preemie, and please, Tracy, if you are interested in your gift, please, um, all you have to do is um, give me a personal message in the reply where you comment, and then let me know you won, and, um, I really like for you to do it as quickly as you can. I understand you don't live on YouTube, but um, if you can, as quickly as you can, um, respond to me that you're interested in your baby. And here are, I, I feel bad that she's not put together yet, but as you know from the other videos, life has been heck. But she's got beautiful little feet that I haven't finished. Um, but she will be done by the, um, by the end of the week, and um, she should be to you by early to mid next week. So, um, yeah, you're gonna have a little baby. And um, if you are not interested in her, or if I do not hear from you, you know, I'll give you a little bit of time, then I will do the drawing again. And um, uh, so yeah, just please just put a reply in the thing that says you you realize that you won. And um, everybody else, thank you so much. I've enjoyed you guys so much. And don't, please do not stop asking the questions and just keep, Keep them coming because, you know, we're going to do more of these. I've done so many, and um, we're going to do more, and um, I've already determined what the next one's going to be, and so we're just going to have some fun with it. Let's roll on and roll on and float on and enjoy each other, and I love you guys so much, and thanks for watching, and okay, oh my gosh, oh my god, we're at 14 minutes. That's my longest video, I think, ever. Love you guys. Bye.